so she owes some fasting and this year she's pregnant approaching this Ramadan what is she gonna do look Akhi, pregnancy and breastfeeding only if the woman who is pregnant or breastfeeding cannot fast or advised by her physician not to fast skip fasting you're not blameworthy but in this case how many days you skipped last Ramadan? I owe seven days since last Ramadan. And this Ramadan perhaps due to pregnancy, it's not like giving an option of not fasting at all. If the doctor said you cannot fast, then you shouldn't be fasting. If you yourself, you feel that the day is short and I can afford fasting, then you should fast. So whatever number of days you skip during this Ramadan as well, Whenever you give birth and whenever you're not breastfeeding or whenever you can fast, you still have to make them up 7 or 15 or 20 or 30. The alternative which is feeding for each day, if the person is not expecting to be capable to fast in the future. This is for chronic ailment and diseases. May Allah keep us all safe.